How do you feel being in the camera? I don't know, it's so weird that I need to focus on my posture. Oh, <laughs> this is weird. Do your usual, do, no. do your thing. <laughs> this is actually super weird, bro. Like, hello. <laughs> Think so. <laughs> <laughs> You're making things fun. What what is your intro anyway? It's like hi hey guys. Yeah. Okay. Let's do it together. One, two, three. Hey, hey guys. guys. <laughs> <laughs> You're not putting that in there. You're not. No. You you go for it. This is your channel. This is your um time to shine. Yeah. Go. <laughs> it's actually you okay. Hey okay. <laughs> Stop! We're gonna spend like freaking 15 sorry, minutes sorry, on this. Okay, 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 go, go. You can't look there, you gotta look here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> What's going on? Why? I actually need water, hold up. Sauce. <laughs> okay. ASMR. For all you ASMR, do you like ASMR? I find it satisfying, but I don't. I'm not like an addict. Are I, you? I think I am. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel, and today we have a very special guest. That's very nice. The only time I'll be nice to you. <laughs> no, actually. <laughs> No, ouch, no, I'm actually, so I'm, actually, I'm actually like sweet with it to her. So today we will be doing the best friend tag. The, mo the first question. Actually, I wrote it down here. Are you ready? I think so. <laughs> okay. How and when did you and your best friend meet? Well, we met in school. For how long? See, the story don't match up. Exactly. It, it really does not it match up. It does not. And this is like an actual, like a serious problem we actually have. <laughs> so like she thinks we met back in like third grade. I we don't think. We were best think... friends. <gasps> no, 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 no. And like I do not recall. Like I do not recall that. I do not think. That's the problem. I literally, sh guys, she forgot we were best friends back in fourth grade or even third grade. But I, I remember fourth grade for sure. We were best friends in fourth grade. I remember flying without wings. Yeah. If any of like See? fifth grade people are watching. Fifth grade, oh right? My God. Yeah, fifth grade. And like y'all remember, y'all know flying without... Our concert, our school our concert. concert. <laughs> it, was, it, was, it was bomb. See, so we used to be friends, you we, remember. I just, I don't remember you. I remember that year. Was I, I just, that irrelevant? <laughs> Okay, no, it's not that. It's just I really do not recall. Like, that part is erased from my memory. Like, it is not there. It's in the archives somewhere. So it's not in your archive. It's clearly deleted. <laughs> Delete. <laughs> but basically, to answer the question, we were best friends in back in back in fourth grade. She doesn't remember that, but I swear there is proof of her giving me a goodbye letter or something like that. That was pretty sweet, though. I, I know, right? That was nice. That was cute. That's not, actually, I proved that we were best friends when I told you a secret you told me back in fourth grade. Literally. You shocked, you remember? Literally. Like, I think four years ago, I was like, you remember you told you telling me this, this, and that, and she was so shocked that I knew. I was like, how you know that? But yeah, she literally knew, and she remembered it word by word, which is really, really shocking, considering yeah. the fact that I don't even remember the friendship, but she remembers something I told her word for It's I, I still can't believe by the way you actually can't remember uh, us being friends. I'm guilty, I'm sorry. Like how? <laughs> a human. That's your freaking best friend right now. Even after we drifted apart, like not literally drifted as a friend, drifted in university, you're somewhere, I'm somewhere, and look at us I right now. I <laughs> literally do not remember. This is bad. It's horrible. It's fine. I'll try forgiving her. I, what can we do? She gets me Starbucks. <laughs> <laughs> if you count that, I usually drop it by the time it gets here. I'm very clumsy. Oh yeah, next question. Let's go, let's talk about the Starbucks. <laughs> we have this like friendship thing, I guess. That whenever she comes over, she gets me Starbucks. I don't know. It's been going for like since school. We're in university, by the way. Like. Third, it, we're in our third year, but yeah. It's on her way. To, it's on my way over to her place. I usually get us both Starbucks. 
And the way I would hold it, hers, mine would never fall because I'd always be drinking it. I, it would be fine the entire way. The entire way. It would be fine until I get downstairs to her place. I get out of the car and it just falls and half of it just is empty. And not like, once, not go. twice. This happened so many times. <laughs> Almost every single time she got me started. It would be fine the entire way to, to your place. But the second I get here, it would just flop. And exactly. I'm like, okay. What's your favorite memory together? I think beach day. Yeah. Beach day with your dad and your yeah. brother. That was so much fun. Yeah. I love that. I think this was like three years ago or like yeah. something like that. Four years? It was so much fun. Yeah. That was so awesome. like we spent the day together with like my family and she came to the beach. Ooh, okay. <laughs> What's something that annoys you about the other? Okay. You start. Here's the thing, okay? Tia. You actually have this planned. <laughs> like, let's say, let's say, let's say. Imagine I'm just like thinking about it constantly. Right? What annoys me. like your time. I'm like shine. listing <laughs> things secretly. No, but like, let's say like, we would, let's say, nothing happened, right? It, she would give off the most dramatic reaction ever. Like, so dramatic. But if we were to be, la subhanallah, in a car crash or something like that, First thing she would do is laugh really hard and then start screaming about it while simultaneously laughing. Like she, in a serious situation, it's like we almost, we, we almost did that. And she's just like, yeah, we just, and I'm just like, T, <laughs> focus. Guys, I do get this a lot and I know this about myself. I am dramatic, even for things that should not, I could like, just like, like have this book fall down i'm like oh my god the book fell. it's not that you're dramatic it's that you laugh in se in very serious situations oh yeah and then that like i actually don't know i actually don't know i i, I can't but do i take things seriously at times you do yes 100 okay. percent. yeah like if it's something serious and we're like listen like this this and that happened she wouldn't laugh in your face true, true. but like if she's in that situation she like she would laugh from the shock i feel like it would just come out blurred out it just well, you clearly have your answer planned. I don't know. I don't know what annoys me about you. You mentioned something yesterday. Okay, I'll mention that since I don't have something actually major to that annoys me about you. Okay. Hmm. Guys, as you can tell, she has curly hair. And FYI, this is her natural hair. And it's beautiful. Like, I love it. Like, I always tell her that. I tell her I love her hair. Curly and all of that. But for the longest time, she has been telling me how much she does not want to straighten her hair. That obviously means she wants to straighten her like hair. Like, you actually have nothing that annoys you about me. Like, absolutely nothing. Like, that is impossible. If you dig in there, I'm sure you can find, like, at least one thing that you're like... True, but... I feel like recently, like, this is not annoying, honestly, it's not like something that's annoying, <laughs> but I don't know, it's like something I need to, like, put it up. <laughs> that's the thing. If I think about something that annoys me about her, then I'll mention it, but for now, it's that. She has been telling me how she doesn't not want to straighten her hair, and I'm like, do it, just straighten your hair, like, just do it. She's like, no, because her goal is to straighten her hair only three times a year. Which, it's okay. pretty extreme, I feel like. Exactly, because she thinks not straightening her hair... No, she thinks straightening her, hair, straightening her hair will ruin her hair. And I'm like, it won't. Like, not once if you do it, like, once every month or something. And she won't. The thing is, she always talks about it. Even yesterday, we had this conversation because she always talks about not wanting to straighten her hair. And she doesn't listen. Literally. And, like, straighten your hair. <laughs> her hair is beautiful, but I love her natural hair. It's not about that. It's about the fact that she does not want to straighten it. means she wants to straighten it. And she doesn't admit that she doesn't want to straighten it. That she, she wants to If you could tell, she's very passionate about this. So, we'll see. We'll wait, see. wait, wait, <laughs> wait. <laughs> Pause. <laughs> Let's make a deal. Go. No, no, an actual deal deal. An actual deal deal. If this gets 150 likes. I think my highest likes was like 112. So, I think we can get 150. Okay. You'll sit in your hair. Like, in, we'll make a video of that. You straightening your hair. That's fair, because I don't straighten it unless there's something to straighten it for. So I feel like 150 likes is a good reason 
to celebrate you guys getting 150 you know yeah. i you have my word on that that's it that's it it is promise just bump on it <laughs> <laughs> that's it we're on it yeah boy next question what phobias does your best friend have I remember Tia's biggest fear, like back in senior year, was getting kidnapped. And I love how we're putting that out there on the internet. But that was honestly her biggest fear. So like whenever we would come back home like late at night or something, she would literally be so scared that like her dad would have to come downstairs to like, <laughs> like take her upstairs. And not only that, she was scared from the movie. What was the movie called? The dude with the skin oh the one where you watch in your house oh, yeah afterwards? i don't I know just, don't yeah i don't i think it was called skin something like that it was about this guy with like like 20 plus personalities who kidnapped oh, like yeah. three girls and he had this like voice that mm -hmm. i used to do to scare her and she would genuinely get scared like genuinely scream mm -hmm. and i feel like that is genuinely her phobia like she cannot watch scary movies she's walked out of theaters before because yeah, she cannot watch a scary movie <laughs> we'd be like a group of friends and then I just be like, no, I really can't. Like, I keep on trying to, but I can't. Remember how I got scared of Twilight when he slept over my house? <laughs> and then, like, you started crying, and I started just crying. Oh my okay, God. I started. <laughs> she scared me so much because I was sleeping. And I then woke up. And she, <laughs> she just started screaming in my face. <laughs> I got scared when I, I was just, looking I just at got, her. <laughs> I just got up and kind of looked at her. And she just started flat out screaming. And it was like 5 a.m. At my face. And I was just like, <laughs> I sat there and I was like, you scared of me. What's going on? And it was like a serious convo afterward because she actually like got like, oh, were you offended? Because she did not want to like sleep in my room. She was like, do you fine? I just like sleep in the living room. I'm like, of course not. Like, no. She's like, you know, like, it's fine. I'll just sleep in the living room. And I was like, oh my God, no, no. And the thing is deep down. <laughs> I was actually afraid of you that moment. <laughs> I actually don't think I admitted to you, but I was scared. I don't know why. Like it was just like this moment. Like I'm not scared of you. Don't worry. I, I remember. Love you. I remember crying because I was like, I was laughing so hard that it made me cry. Because I was like, what is, what happened? Like I just, <laughs> I just looked at her and she yeah. started screaming. <laughs> and I would get scared of Twilight. Who gets scared of Twilight? Uh, it's my favorite movie. Or like Twilight movie, movie series. It's my favorite movie, by the way. I love that movie. It's so scary. You're being sarcastic. No, not at all. I genuinely get scared of it. No, you do? You're joking. You're joking, right? I genuinely get so scared. You're joking, right? I hate you. You're joking, right? Yeah. Okay, okay. Oh, wait. I didn't say what phobia you have. I don't think you have phobias. You know, we we were just talking about mine earlier. Oh, yeah, straightening your hair? <laughs> okay. No. Oh. No. Wait. Remember the Starbucks thing? I was like, I'm going to go get a Starbucks. And you were like... It's driving. <gasps> it's driving. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, what the heck? My biggest fear is, like, being run over. <laughs> or... Why are you laughing? It's not funny. It's not funny. <laughs> I laugh when I'm uncomfortable. I'm sorry. It's... It's not, it's really not And funny. then you made fun of me when I laugh in serious situations. Okay, I feel you on that, for real. Because when I get uncomfortable, I laugh. That's my biggest fear is like being hit by a car or like being in a car crash, like a really bad one. So I do not drive. And the thing because is, she, of that. she hasn't drove for the past six months. And she's like, after tomorrow, she wants to take me to Starbucks and she wants to drive. And I do not know how I feel you're about safe. that. I promise you're safe. I hope. We're gonna find out. I hope. <laughs> beach or city? I know yours, beach. Definitely. Beach? Yeah. I'm more of a beach person. Yeah, right? We are gonna swim tomorrow. I, I'm tomorrow. holding myself so much because I really wanna go like Scorpio gang or like water sign gang. I feel like that's just not, that's not okay. I will not do that. I will not bring zodiac signs into everything that I do in my life. That is so you. <laughs> this is so her. Like anything that I do, we do, she does, he does, her does, her does, her does. <laughs> anything her does. that happens around her has to do with zodiac signs. 
literally. Like I wouldn't I wouldn't not like a person because they're a Leo, for example. But like, you know, it ex- <laughs> it's interesting to look into to like dive deep, you know? It's, it's cool. It's What's your cool favorite stuff. sign? Obviously your sign. No, I actually don't like Scorpios. Oh. I mean, I do. I like Scorpios cuz I'm a Scorpio. But like my ultimate I like all signs. But my favorite favorite sign would probably be Sagittarius. I just Sagittarius's or Cancers to go. I love Cancers. So you love Noor more than me. You're telling me this indirectly. <laughs> yeah. Ah uh-uh, no. Okay. No. I like Noor's sign because water and water. You know, it's like fire and water. Like, sh- ouch. Guys, by the way, Noor is like we are like a trio. Our friendship is a trio. A th- it's called a trio, right? A three. Yeah. And Noor is like the third, but she's like. Shout out Noor. Social distancing or something. Mm-hmm. Social distancing. Yeah. We love you, Noor. She clearly loves you more than me, so whatever. I don't have a sign, favorite sign, because I don't know, I'm not that into stuff as much as she is. But it's okay. It's okay. I love me. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Imagine something I can be caught dead wearing. Imagine this whole time it's not filming. Do you want to check? Is it? Okay, good. It's filming. Okay, mention something you can be caught dead wearing. I feel like leggings. All you wear is leggings. Me? Okay. Okay. Literally leggings. I think for you to be a sundress. <laughs> a sundress, yeah. <laughs> yeah? Definitely. Next question. And I think it's our last. Unless we decide. We missed to... one. What did I miss? That have I ever had surgery? <gasps> oh, yeah. Okay, okay. Last two questions. Have I ever had surgery? I don't think you have. I think you were going to have one in your knee. Oh yeah, but I forgot about this, you know, I would not- Wow, damn girl, okay! I got you! Damn! But I think, yeah, I don't think you had one, unless it was like re- when you were really, really young. I don't know, I don't think I had one either. Well, I know yours, you had one. I had two, actually. The Zyda surgery. Yeah, yeah, that was a nightmare. Back in 10th grade, you know why? She eats a lot of KFC and Pepsi! Like breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I definitely do eat Pepsi, but like. Eat Pepsi, I know. <laughs> oh, you're making fun of me? I was making fun of you! <laughs> I feel like we're kind of the complete opposites. We are. She has a whole personality, and I have a whole other personality. Like, she's not healthy, I'm healthy. You're into makeup, I'm into sports. Literally. Literally, you're we both laugh at uncomfortable situations. We ex- though, so yeah, that's something. We both like watching movies. <laughs> I hate movies. Oh, actually. okay. Then I you like reading. Movies. I love reading, but I think you love le- reading more than me. Obviously, I love movies. I hate movies. You I watch don't YouTube the whole time, but they're not movies. You know, does that count? Like, I don't know. We're just the complete opposite. Though we're best friends, then opposites right. attract. You know, like fire and water. You know. <laughs> Last question. Yes. This was really fun, actually. Right? I enjoyed this too. Actually, I really did. Right? Like, I really enjoyed this. <laughs> okay. Ouch. No. Our best friend tag paper. Okay. Last question. Best school memory together. Or like memory. best school memory. I think that I think prom. I was gonna say the same thing. I, oh my god, prom! Prom was so much fun. Like mm. we got the limo over to your place. Yeah, and, and like a group of girls. But yeah, yeah. <laughs> but we yeah, it was just so much fun. Yeah. Graduation was fun too. Like oh, the yeah. after dinner for graduation was it really was. fun. And we took a limo for that too. You know what else? Sports day. Oh yeah. That was nice. If you oh guys didn't know, like, Tia was honestly amazing when it came to, like, planning. Like, she planned graduation. She was a valedictorian in graduation. She planned, like, our senior, like, hoodies and everything. You're making me shy now. <laughs> Literally, prom planned by her. She was prom queen too. What you mean? Go messy, that's what so messy. But, yeah, like, she... Pla- oh. <sighs> But like, yeah, she planned a lot of things and it was actually like really, really fun. Like, w- like it was great. Like, amazing planner. I, feel I don't know why I keep this book. Right? Yeah. It's like our thing now. We have to make a handshake. Now? 
That's like the most basic handshake we made. <laughs> I think this is the end of the video. It's the end. I'm kind of sad about it. Right? We actually had fun. It was actually fun filming it. I'm sad about I it. I actually really enjoyed filming this. It was fun. It was. It was. Nora just being <laughs> Did I introduce your name? In the beginning? No. I said this is my friend, right? Yeah. Guys, this is Nora! <laughs> <laughs> Hi. <laughs> I'm Nora. So this is the end of the video. I really hope you guys enjoyed watching it with my bestie Nora. And if you guys want another like a part two or something with her, then let us know. So this is the end of the video and if you guys like it, don't forget to give it a a thumbs up and a comment. No a subscribe I suck at this to her YouTube channel y'all yes and comment down below what video she should do next <laughs> bye I suck at this <laughs> I suck at this how do you do this <laughs>